at the fourth annual Blue and Gold Week Rally, where the Student Alumni Association has worked hard this year to make it a little different, but with all the same Bruin spirit. The rally consisted of traditional favorites, with cheers, Bruin bears, and our famous eight clap. <laughs> UCLA's premier acts bolstered this Bruin affair. In preparation for Saturday's standoff with Stanford, Coach Neuheisel and the Bruin football team pumped up the crowd. This is the big one right here. This is the big one. I want to know how many of y'all think we're about to put a whooping on the Stanford Cardinals. Our season hasn't gone the way we had envisioned it to go uh, to this point, but we got uh, six more games left, and we're going to turn things around, and we're going to get a W for you guys this Saturday. But something was different from last year. Making sure this campus is safe has decided to adhere to the red flag fire warning in the area, which means we won't be able to light the bonfire tonight. Some areas still are under red flag warning conditions, and we thought it would be prudent to not have the bonfire. Obviously, the student population really felt bad about it, and as we do, too. Uh, we, like, we like to see the spirit, we like to see the enthusiasm that, the, that everybody puts out there. While the crowd was boisterous, some students still miss the traditional bonfire. Most people were looking forward to just like a big fire. And some questioned the decision to cancel the fire. I think it all depends on whether it was just like they were scared or there was actually a good reason, like if the fire could have actually spread, like what the likelihood of that would be. But the campus fire marshals discussed the dangerous fire conditions. Due to current fire conditions, it was it was necessary. Campus EMTs, who are also students, said... We were just here for safety purposes. I mean, if anything had happened or if anybody needed medical aid. Bonfire or not, the rally prepared Bruins to bring Stanford down. I don't think we need a bonfire to kick, kick anybody's behind. While some UCLA students may have been disappointed by the fire marshal's decision not to have a bonfire this year, the Bruin spirit is still brightly burning. Reporting to you for DPTV, I'm Piata Sotile.